Here's a video of your 2021-22 RR. Um, check the lug nuts. We've torqued them. The factory's torqued them, but uh, being aluminum, they're a little soft. You should check them and inspe uh, inspect them periodically. There's a quick connect underneath there. So if you want to hook up an outside grill, you can plug it right into there. Uh, TV hookups. There's a bracket here so you can hang your TV. Intake exhaust for the furnace. You got a power awning. That's 12 volt. You got stabilizer jacks on the corner. So once you back it up into your site, you get it all set up, crank the jacks down. That'll give you some stability. Uh, two 20 pound tanks. They're both full and ready to go. You got your battery up front and you got your power jack. This will raise and lower it. Here's your VIN number. Um, there's your build date. Uh, water heater runs off gas or electric. If you want it to run off electric, there's a switch here. If you want it to run off propane, the switch is inside. So electric switch outside, propane switch inside. And um, that guy's your drain plug. Okay, the sewer, um, what you do is you remove this cap, hook your own sewer hose up, or hook a sewer hose up, pull the gate valve in the front. That's for the toilet, dump it. Once that's com uh, completely empty, Leave the valve open, hook a hose up, and you can flush that black tank out for a few minutes. Shut the valve, or shut the hose off, close the valve, pull the gray. There's no need to rinse that out. That's just soapy drain water, kitchen sink, bathroom sink, and that'll kind of clean out your sewer hose for you. This is where your water hookups are going to go. City water's to the right. Hook your hose up. You run off the pressure from the hose. Otherwise, you fill the tank up by taking the cap off, sticking a hose in there, and filling it up. There's cable TV input here. Outside shower, security light. There's your 30 amp power hook up there. There's a vent you can open from inside and that'll circulate some air for you. Um, this one's wired for a backup camera so you can you can uh, get a Furion camera and you can just plug it right into there and then the monitor's loose that plugs into your cigarette lighter. Here's your heating and cooling. One button on the bottom. You can do fan, low or high. You can do the air conditioner, low or high. Uh, auto is the thermostat control. And then uh, heat. And then that's off. Uh, most of your controls are here. Push a button to let you know how full the battery is. It's third. Fresh water tank is full. Black and gray are empty. Water pump is for the fresh water tank. So if you're pulling the water out of the tank, use the pump. If you're hooked up to city water, then you just run off the pressure from the hose. Propane switch for the water heater. Uh, lights. And then this is your awning extend retract. That's 12 volt. Push a button, it runs out. Push a button, it runs in. Refrigerator runs off the solar panel and the battery. That's 12 volt. Um, here's a battery disconnect. Turn that key and that'll disconnect your battery. Um, all your breakers and fuses are in here. So anything that runs off electricity runs through a breaker. Anything that runs off the battery is fused. If a fuse blows, a light will come on. It'll let you know exactly which fuse is blowing. So if you walk by here and you see something on, there's probably a fuse blowing. foot pedal flush so what you do is you drop your chemicals in there there's some that comes with it and that'll break the waste down break the toilet paper down help with the odors um, there's a GFI here so if you lose power to all the outlets maybe you tripped a breaker or you trip this so you can just reset it by pushing it in just like at home hope this video helps you uh, of course you can give me a call if you need something thanks Mike